Welcome to our FB page na free reviewers managed by Lunalin. Now, balikan naman natin itong random post dito sa civil service exam, isa sa isa sa ating mga FB groups na lagi nating tinatambayan. So, ito yung tingnan natin kasi baliktad yan siya. Nasagutan na natin ito number 1. So, sa video ito, dito tayo sa number 2, number 3, and number 4. Mas maganda siguro ang i-post nyo muna yung video bago nyo mapanood yung mismong mga detalying sagot nito. Let's do number 2. What is 30 over 65 in its simplest form? Paano ba natin ito mas simplify? We can only simplify this by finding the greatest common factor. Para sa iba pang detalye or for more examples about greatest common factor, pwede yung i-search. Greatest common factor, tapos idugtong lang yung lunalin para mas madaling ma-sort out yung dati na nating na-upload regarding sa greatest common factor. Now, ang greatest common factor dito sa 30 and 65 ay 5. 30 divided by 5, and this is 6. 65 divided by 5, and this is 13. So, ang sagot dito ay 6 over 13. Next, number 3. Few na exercise from 4.05 p.m. to 4.32 p.m. Which part of an hour did Fiona use for exercising? Kunin natin yung difference. So, 4.32 p.m. at 4.05 p.m. Difference meaning, i-minus lang natin yan siya. So, since pariho lang naman na 4 yan nang dyan, dito tayo sa 32. 32 minus 5, and this is exactly 27. Itong 27 na yan, yan yung 27 minutes. Now, yung tanong, which part of an hour itong 27 minutes? Ang isang oras, convert muna natin into minutes, ang isang oras ay equivalent sa 60 minutes. Yung 27 minutes, yan yung numerator natin. Yung mismong total or yung kinukumpara natin, yung kabuuan, yan yung 60 minutes. Para sa final na answer, kailangan natin simplify yan by finding the greatest common factor. Ganon ka-importante yung greatest common factor. So, ang greatest common factor dito ay 3. 27 divided by 3 and that is 9. 60 divided by 3 and this is 20. So, ito na yung sagot. 9 over 20. Now, let's do number 4. What is the greatest common factor of 16 and 20? Solution number 1. Doon tayo sa ano ba to? Yung long division ba yung tawag nito? I-divide muna natin ng 2. 16 divided by 2 kasi parehong even so ma-divide natin ng 2. And this is 8. 20 divided by 2, this is 10. Si 8 at 10 ay ma-divide pa natin ng 2. 8 divided by 2, this is 4. 10 divided by 2 and that is 5. Wala nang common sa dalawa. Yung greatest common factor. Ito lang ang i-multiply natin. 2 times 2 and that is 4. Another way of finding the greatest common factor ay i-list down natin yung mga factors ni 16 at ni 20. Mga factors ni 16 ay 16, we have 8, 4, 2, 1. So 20, 20, mayroon tayong 10, 5, 4, 2, 1. Yung mga common factors nilang dalawa ay mayroon tayong 1, 2, at 4. While yung greatest common factor dito ay itong 4. Kaya, ang sagot dito ay 
4. Thank you for watching and all I hope mayroon kayong naintindihan sa video ito. Thank you and God bless.